My names are Raji Adekunle, the Chief Ifakunle, the Otun Agbaki of Emure Land. There are a lot of advantages to Ifa. Ifa is the assistant of Olodumari. After God is Ifa. If you have it, door of opportunities will open for you. What are the usefulness of these apps and why are they here? Do you want to use it in worshipping Ifa or is for something else? If a student is studying and is forgetful, these apps can work fine for the kid. Are there any person or you who will say, okay, if I spoke to me and it actually manifested in my life? I just hear that voice said to the stand up before I came to come out with Shefa, but now. But it's not really, not really, not really going well. You don't look like a celebrated superstar. I'm you. What is your name and what festival are you celebrating today? My names are Raji Adekunle, the Chief Ifakunle, the Otun Agbaki of Emure Land. The festival starts from August 20, which is called Odun Ifa, Odun Sheshe, all around the world. It will be starting on the 30 to 31st. And we have started today, and it has been confirmed today, and we are going to do a lot of stuff, and a lot of people will be here to pray as well. What are the advantages of IFA, and why do people need to own IFA or be initiated to IFA in Yoruba land? Is it only for Yorubas or all around the world? There are a lot of advantages to IFA. People looking for children, women looking for husband, people looking for a good work, promotion at your workplace, even those that want to travel abroad that are saying there is disappointment, if you own a IFA, there are so many advantages to it, like what to eat and what not to eat like where to go, where not to go. Those are the advantage of IFA. IFA is practiced all around the world and not only in Yoruba land. IFA is the assistant of Olodumare. After God is IFA. is the one that shows way if someone wants to be crowned in a particular village or you want to create a village or you want to take a step you will consult ifa some people see traditional practice and things like this like ifa as evil for someone like me who doesn't know about traditional practice if i visit someone and i see something like this I might decide not to eat and think the person is fetish or is a bad person. Does this signify that the person is evil, fetish or a bad person who I shouldn't get close to? That's a good question. A lot of people talk about Ifa like it's not something you can get close to. It's something you should do and you can get close to it. Is very good, and in fact, it doesn't mean that you are selfish, or it doesn't mean that you will sacrifice someone to worship Ifa. Ifa is a very good thing to have. If you have it, door of opportunities will open for you. I can see a lot of herbs here and for someone like me that doesn't know anything about traditional practice or if I would think like it's just wheat. What are the usefulness of these herbs and why are they here? Do you want to use it in worshipping Ifa or is for something else? You see these herbs, 
I'm happy that you asked this question. You see these apps and Ifa had a covenant. And the kind of covenant they had is that there is no kind of person who will bathe with soap and won't rinse his or her body with water. That is how these herbs are to Ifa. Yoruba proverbs. That is Yoruba So we use these herbs to bait Ifa. And after baiting Ifa, when you speak to your Ifa, everything you ask for, you will get. This herbs works a lot when it comes to Ifa. We use it to bait Ifa and to help people. What are the different kind of herbs we have here? And can you name some of them and the benefit to human health aside from Ifa? You see all these herbs that we bait Ifa with are very good herbs and they have a lot of benefit and there is no herbs here that is not used for something else. These herbs is called shako and it does wonder. It's always big. If someone is looking for something good and something big, it works for it. If you bait with it, you will get to the right place. Secondly, this is ojiji leaf. If someone is dull, or if I did not say what exactly they need into here, if you bait with this, the person will gain his memory back. This can be used for a lot of stuff. This OGG leaf. If a student is studying and is forgetful, these herbs can work fine for the kid. That's it for that. As if a devotee, does it affect any other part of your religion, either Muslim or Christianity? You see, about Ifa, it doesn't affect anyone. We human create enmity in everything. Elegy Dumare created everyone into this world to be good. In Ifa, there is a Udu. When being given to you, if it's to a Muslim child, they will encourage him to go to the mosque. There is another one for a Christian, they will tell them and encourage them to go to the church. There are lots of it. Even there is one which are for the awokpas that will put a white garment around their neck. Ifa is closer to every religion in this world and it doesn't separate one or condemn one. Based on what you said about Ifa encourage some people to be a Muslim, like the person who is a Christian or a Muslim will have his own Ifa. Will he have something, a white stuff like this or not? If we have a Ifa like that, and we take him to Ibodu, we take him to Ibodu to initiate him, and that is the kind of Odu that comes out for the person. The person must keep going to mosque, and he will have his own Ifa. But if the person came to find out about his personal life, and the Ifa speak the truth, we will just warn the person that he or she should go to mosque or church. So that things can go smoothly for him. And if the person wants to get initiated, the person can do it. But if Infa makes it compulsory, the person must have it.
as a traditional worshipper in Nigeria. What is your advice for the coming generation who doesn't practice anything traditional anymore? Everybody now, they would just want to be Christian or either Muslim once they see you as a traditionalist. Okay, so once they see you as a traditionalist, they see you as an evil person or probably a devil. What is your advice for everyone and for the generation coming behind us? Firstly, it's a good question. I will advise everyone that if you've been told that this is your religion, then follow it. Don't do any other person's religion. As long as they tell you this is your religion, it's either Babalawu or being a pastor. Where some are doing it because of the greed, when a child is born, in a traditional way, we consult to know what religion or the ways it's going to follow. If it's true, the mother's side or the father's side, the work is going to learn or the work is going to do to be successful, we will know. That is why some people won't be led astray. Everyone around the world both in Nigeria and abroad, they should try and listen. Whatever part you're told to follow, you should follow. It's like I came here now. If, if he receives me well, huh? as a visitor, he receives me well, and I like what I saw here and I enjoyed, then when I, that is the reason I will come next, is it not? Yeah. Because of what I found here, the hospitality or one thing or the other. Then, so the question I was asking her when they talk about traditional practices and all. I said, if if her during celebration, but when she was celebrating, when she was explaining it, they ask questions, they give you things, they tell you things about future and all that. Then I now ask, if for example, they did it two years ago, three years ago, and I watched it, and I saw last year, and I'm here at this year, is there any person that could say, oh, certain things he told me, if I told me last year, actually became part of my life this year, and I saw it, and I experienced it. That was the question I was asking. Is it clear now? Only thing I want to be point is this. Is here because I watched it two years ago, three years ago, two years ago, and last year, and this year I'm here myself. I'm asking, are there any person or you who will say, okay, if I spoke to me during this celebration of Ifa festival, and he spoke to me, and it actually manifested in my life. And that is the reason I was spoken to me last year. I'm here this year again. Okay, so we have our brother that will be answering that because he has he can testify. Okay, so uh, uh, good afternoon everyone. Good afternoon. My name is Yusuf Adile. Likewise, people know as uh, Yusuf Sintudu. Um actually when we talk about Ifwa, Ifwa is great because I've went to a lot of plays, both pastor, Afwa, what they are saying is not right. Last year that I entered uh, Igodu, when they now started mentioning my Ifwa, when they are mentioning that Ifwa, Ifwa now speak that, be careful on anything that you will be eating in your house. Ifwa said, you don't eat what you want to eat in your house. I said, yes. Ifwa said, if I go out and I'm coming back home, if I did not eat outside, when I get home, I'm not going to eat what I'm supposed to eat. I say yes. Housewife, another person is... Your wife is so faithful. Yes. Okay. So, when I get to my house, if I said, I'm going to know. Before this time, you didn't know? I didn't know. I've been watching, I've been watching. And now, sleep one day. I just hear that voice said, so you stand up, go outside. I just step outside like this. I saw her with another man. I said, if I can paro now, if I saw for me, and if I said, guy, don't eat this. If you eat this, we are fitting you. Don't be using this to be using it. Even those things, some people are forcing me to be using it. And when they are doing that, um, that's if I to me, if I said, that thing that they said is actually not supposed to be using it, but they will be forcing me. Even in my in my dream, when I sleep, they will be coming through my dream that I should use that 
said never and everything come up. Thank you very much. Before I came to come out, Shefa, the, the Fuji that I'm singing, I've not been collecting shoes. You understand? I've been just been looking like this. But now, but I'm really, really, really going well. You don't look like a celebrated superstar. <laughs> <laughs> it's a glasses. And I'm talking to you like this. Eh? I just. I have a show in the Guru today. Thank you very much. So, nice. So I wanted to get that clarified. At least somebody is talking about what he saw here, what he experienced here, and why he is here and he's always playing the basic.